we are all ready to go here alongside Ray Ferraro. I'm James Sabalski. Puck drop about to go. A sight every hockey fan can appreciate. It's a clean sheet of ice, and we are about to get underway. Puck is dropped, and we are underway. This has been one we've been waiting for for a while, and it's time to finally see what the payoff is all about. Moscow's got the puck in the defensive end. Denies him on the play. That's a lot of hard work for him to make this stop because he's got to find the puck first before he can get his body in front of it. Here's a short pass to Carlson. St. Petersburg's got a hold of the puck. Slides the puck over to Dennis. The Russians get a hold of the puck along the boards. Moves it quickly over to Anthony. Great defensive play to come up with the puck. Unable to reach that one. Great stick work with the steal. Passes ahead from the right side. St. Petersburg's got the puck in their own end. Dennis gains the zone. Picks up the puck in his own end. And he slides it quickly to Datsu. The Sound Tigers gain control of the puck against the wall. Right in the open ice. That one's picked off. Moves it to Dennis. From along the wall, takes a shot. Big save by the goaltender. The frozen biscuits dropped, and we are back underway here. And now he passes up to Dentsu. It's in the back of the net. He scores! I'm not so sure what the D's doing back there, James. I mean, if they turn the net around, he's in great position. As it is, he's a bystander. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. Takes the return feed. Moscow's looking to break out. Quick pass to Anthony. And a great save! Lifts the stick and takes the puck. Along the wing, up the neutral zone. Grabs the puck in the slot. It's in. He scores. Bang, bang. Two goals and right around a minute 40. Wow, insane how quick that was. Bang, bang. Yeah, the defending team just couldn't put a stick in the ground. They couldn't stop them. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. St. Petersburg's been the better team here over the last few minutes, increasing their lead to two. Puck picked up by Nachuskin. Puck lands back onto a stick. Pass back to the point. Dennis receives the puck. Now he's a dangerous guy. He's got two goals already. With the steal. The Sound Tigers have it against the wall. Rocks him on the play. Great timing to come up with the interception. Holds the puck at the line. With the one-timer. And it comes up with the save. Oh, I like this, James. They've really cycled the puck well on this shift. Now they can hold it, and you put the pressure on the defenders. Eventually, they pull you down, or you get a great chance. Oh, he's trying to shoot that off the glass, James. Under a little bit of pressure, he panics, shoots it over the window. Now he's got to go feel shame for two minutes. <laughs> then you go free after that, right? And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. Puck knocked loose after that hit. Blocker saved by the goalkeeper. Nears the blue line and looks to set up at the point. Moves the puck forward to the middle. Straight up the middle. Here they come. Great defensive effort with the strip. Offside is the call, but we'll have a face-off just outside the offensive zone. St. Petersburg's capitalizing their offensive abilities here in this first period. This neutral zone face-off set to go, and we are back underway. Quick feed to Bure. Deep inside the defensive end, still trying to clear. Trying to get something going here with this man advantage as they start from their own end. 
Play blown dead. Penalty coming up here. I know he doesn't like the call on this one. Nobody does, but I think he has a case here, Ray. Well, it looked like the penalty was going to be called, and then it got sold even more so. So that's a hooking call that he doesn't really like. He scores! He completes the hat trick! And here come the doors opening up. They'll come out to clean up the hats that are going to... So play the puck from behind the net. From behind the net. Pins them against the boards as they battle for the loose puck. Even though they don't get one on the power play here, they still have a comfortable lead. The one thing you don't want to do is give up a shorthanded goal. Maybe that sparks the other team a little bit. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. And forces a huge turnover here with the steal. When you get behind, you start to get a little frantic. There's an example of a player trying to force a puck into a zone that's not there. Here's a chance on the doorstep. Referee singling for a delayed penalty. Looks like they caught that slash. Nachuskin's stick work will land him two minutes for slashing. A little bit of frustration there. He's out of position and he gets called for slashing. Moscow's man advantage unit will take to the ice for the first time tonight. They've worked on the power play a lot in practice over the last couple of days. This is their first one tonight, and they'll want to execute what they've worked on, which is to win the draw and start moving the puck. Grabs the puck at center. Nearing the final 60 seconds here this first period. And that's just out of reach. St. Petersburg's gained possession along the boards. Moves the puck down low. And that's taken by the defense. Thunder is hit. You can hear it all the way from up here. Lots of times I miss playing, James. That's not one of them. I like I'm in a suit right now. That one hurt. The Sound Tigers are up big here late in the first period. Puck is dropped, and we are back underway. Trying to clear the zone. And clearing attempt is a big success on that play. There are rock stars, and then there's next level to that. And our guest coming up in period number two defines it. Snoop Dogg coming up here on EA Sports. St. Petersburg's... Look at this. He's calling him out here, Ray. Yeah, he wants to go. He's not very happy. I have been looking forward to this one for a while, but coming up, period number two, the one, the only, Snoop Dogg in the house.
Ray Ferraro down at ringside. James Sabalski up here in the broadcast booth. And what a treat we've got right here. The one, the only. Snoop Dogg is in the his house. Can I say that? Oh, yeah, you can say that, big gang. James, you know what it is, baby. How you doing? I'm slow motion. You got three teams in California now. You got the Sharks, the Ducks, and the Kings. You're all about California love. Do you have love for all three, or is there only one? All of them, especially if they make it to the Stanley Cup. You know what I'm saying? Because they're going to call Snoop Dogg to come drink out of the cup. <laughs> you did. And would you? Why not? Not why. Have you? Yes, sir. You have drank out of the Stanley Cup? Yeah, when the Kings had it, they gave me a slip. Of course. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. And that one's picked off in the neutral zone. Right away. What no! The goalie wasn't having that. Not today, not good, now. Huh? No way, no how. Moves the puck along the half wall. Feeds it over to Datsuk. Puck picked up in the open ice. With the stop. You got into hockey at a young age, listening to Chick Hearn. Favorite team growing up? Favorite team growing up would have to be L.A. Kings. What about the Ducks-Kings rivalry? Is there something there now? I think it's a little rivalry there, considering that the Ducks did happen to win the, you know, Stanley Cup once upon a time. And, uh, you know, that, that rubs, you know, rubs the right way when you can win one of them things. If you were commissioner for a day, what would you do? I would make all hockey games start off with some hip-hop music. I would have a great halftime performance, and the games would be more interactive as far as finding ways to put the people involved, not put them on the ice, but just make it more about the people. Like, when I watch other sports, I feel like the fans are more involved. So finding ways to create ways to make it all about everybody involved, the players, the fans, and the people watching at home. Like how? Just put some snoop on it, you know? That's what I do. I can get down with that. Yes, sir. Hey, look, I know I'm no Chick Hearn, but do you want to still hang around and watch the rest of this period? Look here, James, I got a little bit of time on my hand. Let's do it, baby. Let's enjoy this. There he is. He's going to hang out with us. Let's go. Referee signals penalty coming up here with a delayed call. And there's the whistle stopping the play. Let's see what the officials are calling. They're off to the box. Boarding is the call. Sometimes the sound of the hit is what draws the penalty. A five-on-three with plenty of time to work with here coming up. When this puck is moved side to side on a five on three, you're gonna rotate those penalty killers around. Eventually, you're gonna tire them out. I don't mind taking a shot, but it can't be a bad one from the wing. Get it on the net. The Sound Tigers lead in a big way here in this second. They have been on fire offensively. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. A chance in front. Easily kicked away by the goalie. Here's a short pass to Carlson. Off his stick. Scores! Wow. Goal. What a goal. Finesse team. Mm. Spectacular. Slipped and slide and slide and slipped it. For shizzle? Oh, for shizzle dizzle. Andrews won the draw here in the open ice. Moves it quickly over to Andrew. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. St. Petersburg's offense came to play in a big way, and they lead big time here in the second. Face off here in the neutral zone, and we are back underway. On the attack along the boards. Jostling for the puck, and it's knocked away. And uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. Picked off in the open ice. Huge play in his own end to come up with the puck. I don't believe the coaches are going to be too worried about this. They didn't score on the power play. But I think it's most important that they didn't give anything up. They've got such a nice lead. The coaches are more focused on making sure this game plays out comfortably. Here's a chance to make something happen inside the neutral zone. Nice pass. And look at that sip down oh. the ice to wave off icing. You've got to get past the hash marks to get it waved off. He does a good job. Takes control of the puck. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Gets it out of his own end. Icing is called, stopping the play dead.
St. Petersburg's dominated right from the start. Their offense clicking on all cylinders, and they lead here in the second. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Some great thievery in the open ice. Tries to get it over to Anthony. The Sound Tigers have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Moves it to Datsu. What a steal in his own end. Along the half wall with the puck. And down he goes as the puck goes free. From behind the net, looks to break out. Anthony's got it on the offensive end. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. Stopping the play. St. Petersburg's been dominating at all ends of the ice, especially offensively here late in the second. Puck is dropped and play resumes. Now he slides it up to Nijuskin. And that's intercepted. With possession along the wall. St. Petersburg's got the puck along the boards. Yokiharu's got it across the line. Moves behind the net. Near the point. Here he is in front. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Puts it to the front of the net. Lugs the puck into the corner of the offensive zone. The Russians scoop it up along the boards. Receives the pass. What a score! Back in the net. Back in the net. Back in the net is the right. Whatever you want to call it, just drop it in there. Well, it's a goal no matter how you want to call it. Snoop, you like it? Goal! I like it. Love it. Puck grab by Yokiharu. Moves it on over to Carlson. From the neutral zone now. Moscow's got a hold of it against the wall. And he passes it up ahead to Datsu. Oh! On the back oh side. That's an old school save right there. That's old school, baby. The Sound Tigers with a total team effort to this point as they lead comfortably here in the second. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Big stop just as time expires in the period. All right, third period action just around the corner, but first, our play of the period, Snoop. Hey, man, let's go to the goal, man. You remember that goal that one? Pull that footage up. Let me see. I know it well. And they are ready to drop the puck on period number three. Third period underway here. This has been a total squash to this point. Ray Ferraro is back down at ice level. Ray, 40 minutes played so far. What's been your assessment of this tilt? Moscow's been a step slow almost all game. They haven't had the puck very much. They're losing. If that's going to change, they've got to get the puck and hold on to it much more. Works it across to Datsu. Datsu's got it in the offensive zone. Oh, and he misses an opportunity there. Looking to be too perfect. Get it on the net. You've got a better chance to squeak one through the goaltender than if you miss it outside the net. Passes the puck over to Datsu. Up along the wing. Oh, that's a good hit. With the backhander. And that's a paddling from the goaltender. St. Petersburg's got a hold of it along the wall. And there's the save. 
You put this kind of pressure on, eventually they can't chase you anymore. Now he's got room to carry the puck. Feeds it down low. Moves it around along the half wall. And now it's grabbed by Nachuskin. Quick pass, that and he scores! scores! What a shot! Well, he gets to walk into this and pound it by the goaltender. Nobody picks him up in the high slot. Goalie's not going to get many of these. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. Quick feed to Beret. Return pass. Over the line they come. St. Petersburg's got the puck along the wall. Here's a short pass to Nichuskin. Lays the body. Dished on over to Anthony. St. Petersburg's got it in the neutral zone. There's the whistle icing the call. St. Petersburg showing no signs of slowing down here in this third period up big time. Puck is dropped and we are back underway. Feeds the puck to Dennis. Moscow's gained possession along the boards. Grabs the puck. Moves it quickly over to Carlson. The Russians take possession here in the open ice. Slides it across. Sends the pass over. And he moves it up to Nichuskin. Carlson's got it against the boards. Huge steal at his own end. Centering pass. And that goes off a player in front. Turns it away. I like the goalie's positioning here. He was aggressive enough to make a save on a dangerous chance. Moves the puck along the half wall. Takes a bump and loses control of the puck. And he loses both the puck and his balance after that hit. Sends it quickly to Anthony. And now he moves it quickly to Datsu. St. Petersburg's got the puck along the boards. That puck goes flying into the benches. Yeah. This is why you need to wear a helmet down there, Ray. I'm not wearing a helmet down here with the suit, James. That's just not happening. St. Petersburg's offense has been the story tonight, leading big time here in this third period. And makes the save. Look at this. And they're going to dance off here. Absolutely rocked down to the ice there. That was a heavy blow, and that is the end of this bout. And here comes referee Gilles to clean things up. Ray, it looks like they're not done with each other down there. No, they're going to bark at each other on their way to the penalty box, but into the box they go. Time to sit down. The Sound Tigers offense has been the story tonight as they continue to lead big time in the third. While the centers are jammed up, nice job by the winger to steal the puck. Slides the puck down low. St. Petersburg's got a hold of it against the wall. Here's a shot, and that one's stopped. Trying to escape the pressure. Moves the puck. And forces a huge turnover here with the steal. Moscow's regained possession of the puck. Here they come on the attack. Rocked on the play. Offside the call, and we'll have a face-off just outside the blue line. St. Petersburg's put in one of their most complete efforts that we have seen in quite some time, up big time late in this third. This neutral zone face-off set to go, and we are back underway. Moves it to Dennis. Sends it over. Big time defensive play. Turnover short in the ice. You don't need to take chances if you have the lead. Excellent stick work on the play. Through center along the wing. Picks off the pass. Handles the puck. 
And it looked like he caught him with a high stick. Referee signaling penalty on the play. Did he cut him here? Because they're given four minutes, Ray. Yeah, that's often the case, but sometimes it's a double minor just because of the way the stick makes contact. Center's jammed up, and the winger grabs the puck. Winds up, lets it go, and that's blocked. Here inside the defensive zone, they get the puck. Quick pass, Koyoki Haru. St. Petersburg's got it in their own zone. Right out front, picked off in the open ice. Almost down to the final minute here in this third. Stopped by the goaltender. Tough enough to make the save unless you can see it. He's got to fight his way and find the puck. St. Petersburg's offense has not been a problem tonight. They put a lot of shots on net and lead it big time late in this third period. In the third a chance from the slot. Oh! Special teams coming up huge on that goal. They take advantage of having the extra man by moving the puck quickly. That's a beautiful goal. Moscow's got to be thinking more and more offense here now in the third. No reason to sit back. You're in a hole here. You need goals and you need lots of them. Attack. Oh, and a good heads-up defensive play. And manages to clear the zone. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. With the steal. That's a slash on that play, and the referee's all over it. Let's it go! Can't get it to go. Gets to the bench for the extra attacker. Let's get the call here. Slashing the call, and he's going to pay for it, Ray. Looks like he's chopping wood, James. That was an easy one to call. Good read by the winger as the two setters tie up. Hammerson from the point, scores! No, they're calling it off. They're waving it off immediately. Pretty sure on the ice. Those officials didn't take any time before they waved this one down. Play set to resume, and you can see they're still frustrated by that non-goal call. Puck is dropped, and we are back underway. And the puck leaves the offensive zone. They'll be forced to tag up. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. The Sound Tigers are going to want to bring this big lead home late in the third. Face off here in the neutral zone, and we are back underway. Puck lands right back onto the blade. Lugs the puck back into the neutral zone. And that's all she wrote from this one here tonight. They had the puck the whole time, James. It just goes to figure that they were going to win this game comfortably. Yeah, this the right team won this one tonight. We'll see you next time we drop the puck.